Orlando Pirates and Free State Stars live from the Orlando Stadium in Soweto. Another opportunity for the Buccaneers to extend their lead at the top of the Absa Premiership. They have played two matches more already than the defending champions, Mamalodi Sundowns, who are just three points behind them. But if they win tonight, there is the psychological advantage of six points difference at the top of the table with Sundowns to return from Egypt after their uh, success against al Ahly just a couple of minutes ago. Chance at the back post, saved on the line, but flag was up. That wouldn't have counted, but uh, it was still a very good stop by the keeper. Great reflex save there by Mbambo. If you look at it, very creative in that free kick. He's not offside at this moment. And the ball is played across. Absolutely not offside. I don't know how the assistant got that one wrong. Now chance for Lodge to turn. Matumo got a touch in there. It's still bobbing around. What's the referee say here? He's given the penalty. 35 seconds into the half. And the Buccaneers have a spot kick. And it's Musin Yatama who's got the responsibility. Mbambo, the goalkeeper. And Orlando Pirates looking to get the second half off to a perfect start. And they do so with Yatama, who puts it wide to the left hand side of the goalkeeper. Cool and calm. Execution from Musa Nyatama. Pick this spot. Now Maella, good mazy run, return ball, that's lovely football. Great save from Mbambo, goal by Shonga. And the Buccaneers are two goals to the good, and Maella made that with some stunning skill. Well, for once we've seen Maella absent for most of the first half, getting involved and creating havoc with that run that he made. Chance here for Lorch. He lines it up, the return pass. Well, the ball seemed to bobble, perhaps at the vital moment. And Matumo with a clearance. Mulenga and Lorch did not deliver a third one. Now, a chance to get a third. And to put this issue beyond doubt. Mbambo is beaten, back post! Munetze and it is no goal referee says no goal he's pointing maybe there was a push in there did you see anything Farouk I didn't see anything I think Munetze got a touch to it we'll have to look at it in the slow-mo up to this point there's nothing wrong all he's done was he challenged for the ball seems the the ref thought there was a bit of a push from Munetze but he's all he's doing is he's extending his body towards the ball Look at that, he extends his chest towards the ball. The goalkeeper wasn't impeded either. Yeah, it looks like a legitimate goal to me. This might be number three, Pule misses. Well, this game really has got away from Free State Stars in the second half. It could be 3-4 by now. Well, Pule will, will really kick himself if he looks at this particular club. Well, you have to give them uh, full marks for determination, but it's just that this Pirates team is now on the ascendancy, and it would be, uh, I, I believe it would be a bit unlikely for them to. Well, what is happening here? Seems like the referee has spotted something there. As I was just saying, it would be unlikely for them to get two goals and uh, even things out, but they almost got one here. But it doesn't seem like there was much wrong there, Mark. Look, the ball goes wide here. The cross is made first time. Rogers gets to the ball. What did the referee spot there? I can't see what it... Something in the build-up, perhaps, that we might have missed in that. Uh, but I get the impression that the whistle might have sounded already. Well, he's given the goal. Yeah. Well, total confusion here at uh, Orlando Stadium. What a story that would be, Mahmoudza got the equaliser in the closing stages. Shot from Moby! What a save from Wayne Sandilands! Mark, here's that shot. 
fantastic drive there. They had lots of pace on it. Coach Micho and his uh, Serbian counterpart. A little bit of passion there at the end of the game. Spilled over from the 90 minutes. We hope you've enjoyed the action. Pumlani and Simi will tell us who the man of the match is in a moment. We'll just confirm that Pirates have gone six points clear at the top of the table. In first half, uh, we played the way we wanted. We knew that opponent will play with reinforced defense. Uh, it was very hard to penetrate them, uh, but at least we, possess, we have possessed the ball and created some uh, chances that have not been converted. On half time, we have seen where our problems are, allowing the full backs to go higher up the field, providing exactly that edge that was missing factor in first half. Uh, we have done exactly this with quick fire of two fast goals. We have come in and lead that guarantee us peaceful ending of the match. And then, how is in football? We have chance to score the third goal that was disallowed, that I believe is supposed to, to stay, but uh, it is decision of every, we need to respect. And you have situation that 2-0 is the most dangerous result. 2-1 brings you on back foot. You are fearing to not lose what you already have. I want to give credit to the boys. They fought. This is third match in seven days. Let us, let us put on that account that we have been tired last 15 minutes. In the same moment, I need to say three points are the, what is at present the most important. So much place to criticize what happened in last 15 minutes. Why we have not with four midfielders, uh, with players of fresh legs, why we have not calmed the game, why we have allowed to sit back and allow Devil to come towards us, this is to be criticized. But three points are three points, we shall pick it up and move on. I want to take you back to something nice you said then leading up to these three games about the doors that you had to open. Yes, I told, uh, we need to open three doors of hell and it was not easy playing against Wits winning, against Black Leopards winning and today to win. I need to give credit to the players we have opened. Now we are seeing somewhere on horizon uh, the doors of heaven, but still firmly on the ground, respectful to, for towards also all opponents we are playing. Maritzburg that are fighting relegation, Cape Town that we are going there and last match against Bolokwane here. Mathematics is simple. Ours is to focus on the matches and take every match as it comes as a cup final. Uh, first of all, congratulations to Coach Micho and his technical team. Uh, you can see that uh, they are rising their form. Uh, how end of season is coming. They are playing better and better and they are rising their form. Uh, a brief analysis of today's game uh, in first half. They had fully domination of ball possession. Uh, I am pretty sure that they had more than, than 70%. Uh, but uh, I must mention that in first half we fully controlled uh, the game because uh, we let them to play because we wanted to let them to play. Uh, we close all channels where uh, they can express their superiority uh, and we controlled all dangerous sections areas uh, which can uh, uh, make damage to, to our goal and they didn't have one single shot in first half. Uh, uh, we concede two goals uh, in, in very short period. Uh, and uh, uh, that is why our Pirates one of two remaining contenders for title and what separates them from them and Sundowns from other teams and uh, making big difference between them and the rest of teams because they have masters in, the, in their teams. The rest of us, we don't have such a players like them and uh, thanks to their individual qualities, they scored two, two, two uh, uh, quick goals. Uh, but I think that we made three great subs. In the last 25 minutes, we controlled the ball, we controlled the game, we controlled situation on the field. And I think, uh, I can't say that we deserved the equalizer. Uh, better team won on the end of the day and uh, I wish to Pirates uh, all the best in uh, rest of season 
and I wish them champions title. I'm about to let you go, but I'm, I was just looking at the determination, the drive of your players. You have something to say about that. Just their willingness to fight for this team. Uh, we, we never had problem with that. We never had problem with that. You know, uh, I, I like to say for myself, for my staff and more, for my teams, we are soldiers of Free State Stars. We are soldiers. Uh, I mean, that word can sound uh, too difficult, uh, uh, too hard, because we are not in war. This is sport. This is business. This is job. This is enjoy for all these all, all these wonderful people here. Uh, but we are serving uh, Free State Stars. Uh, we have familiar atmosphere in the team, and it is uh, 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 reflected on every single practice. Before practices, we have our fun hours, and it is reflecting on the games. Uh, only that we are missing is two or three good results in a row to escape from dangerous zone. And the next season, uh, I can promise you now, if we survive this season, next season, Free State Stars will be most pleasant surprise of uh, in PSL and in both cups.